Hello and welcome back. This is the sixth video in the series I'm doing on attaching external storage devices to the iPhone under iOS 13. All of the links to the previous videos will be in the description below and I encourage you to watch those. Today we're going to take a look at the Sony Walkman and see if we can get it to attach to an iPhone. So this is the current low-end model from Sony. It is basically the same size and weight as iPod Nanos of over a decade ago with less features and not as good of a user interface. But this is the current model from Sony on the lower end. So let's take a look at what happens when I plug it in to the iPhone. And there you go, it comes up just like the iPod did. Now, the Walkman has one cool feature that the iPods didn't do in that they were made to have their songs drag and drop. You could extract them very easily or just drop them in the folder. We saw in the last video with the iPods, you could get the songs off if you knew where to look in that redirected, rewritten folder that the iPod created. But on the Walkman, they're just simply in a music folder. So it's real easy to put songs in or take them off. So let's go into my phone here. And I have an MP3 here. So I will copy it to the Walkman, to the music folder. Okay, so we'll unplug the Walkman. We'll go back into its regular mode. Let's attach a little external speaker here. And we will go to the music section, all songs. And there it is. So real easy to do. Much easier than trying to do this on an iPod. So let's have a little fun. Let's add the iPod into the mix. We'll pause that. And I'm gonna bring over a USB hub. Plug it into the iPhone here. And we'll move that hub over here. And then we'll plug the Walkman into the hub. And we'll plug that iPod Nano I had from the last video into the hub. And then we will turn on their respective ports. And they both show up. So let's go into the iPod, into that hidden folder where they scramble all the music names. And there's another song with its cryptic name on it. Let's select that. And we will copy it directly from the iPod to the Walkman. And then we can go back to the Walkman music folder. And there's that odd name but we can rename it. And the name of this song was Ark of the Sun. So once again, if we disconnect the Walkman and it goes back into its regular mode and we go to music, all songs, there's Ark of the Sun now. I think this is really cool because there's no desktop computer involved here. We have three handheld devices and we are able, and two of them don't even have any wireless connection at all, just USB, and yet we're able to manage them without a desktop computer, and the iPhone is sort of the traffic cop of uh, exchanging music from one media player to the other. So that's all for today. Please like and subscribe, hit the notification bell. I will have more videos in the future. Take care.